Hi guys, we're playing Wrestling Empire again, and I will not lie, I don't remember much of where we are right now. On the hospital, okay, that's fitting. I remember I made you guys, but I don't remember who's who, so, okay. Okay, Ashley boss. What a stupid name. Imagine being named Ashley. You're a boy. Okay, I guess he's gone. All right, the show's starting. Oh, it's Babe. Babe, come- No, Elm, stop it. I don't care about you. Babe, come here. I miss you. I miss you so much. You have no idea. Yeah, I'm kind of at a loss right now. Like I said, the only thing I really remember is that I got hit by two trains. Well, actually, it was the same train, just twice. Hi, babe. How are you? We're shaking hands, and this guy's being a weirdo just standing there. Aw, uh, look at me and babe having the time of our lives. Uh, we, we are such good... We, we are such a good couple. Okay, interesting. I was checking my... Okay, okay. Okay, that's not cool. Wait a minute, does green mean that it's my match? Oh, it is, it is. Me versus Cameron Melchin now. All right, here we go. Idle Ghost! Are you my manager, Idle Ghost? Hell yeah, we can do this. What are you doing here, Elm? You can't seriously be expected to referee this match fairly. Hey, leave Elm alone, he's fine. I'm insulted. You think I can't put my feelings aside and be professional about this match? Yeah, tell him, Elm. Well, you better do the right thing, because if you screw with me, there'll be two people getting their asses kicked. What do you mean by that? There's four people in the ring. I think this guy's math is bad. Oh, that's Cameron Melchin. Dude. There we go. Took a second. A gravestone. Bro, imagine getting beat to death. Not to death. Dude, what is wrong with me? And I don't mean as a wrestler. I just mean my mindset. Like, I'm talking about killing people. We are playing a wrestling game. Oh, I'm so sorry, Elm. That was an accident. Dude, this isn't even a house show. There's, like, no one here. Why are, what are, why are we doing this? We are hurting our bodies. Okay. Well, some of us are. Wormwood seems to be kicking everyone's ass. Oh, quickly! The pin! Uh, Wormwood, really? You had to do me like that? Okay, I don't know what that was. I'm getting out of here. That was quite embarrassing. I'm just waiting. I'm waiting for Wormwood to, uh, you know, get off of that sleeper hold. Idle Ghost, can you maybe hit them with that or something? Okay, I didn't mean me. All right, Hest is gone, so it's just me and Wormwood. Let's go. Idle Ghost, get him, quickly. Is that a Bible or something? I don't know what that is. Oh, it's the ring bell. Okay, I was gonna say hit him with the Bible. I mean, whatever you gotta do to secure the victory, you know? That's right, that's what I'm talking about, Idle Ghost. Get the cover, quickly! Wow, of all things, that's what did it. Good job, Wormwood. That was a well-fought battle. Please don't hit me. I think we're friends. I want to be friends. Just take my gloating. Accept your defeat with honor. General G, I see you. Hello, my friend. It's good to see you. I have to pee. All right, come on, quickly. Oh, I was right there, man. Man, can I shower or something? Okay, I guess they're just going to sleep. I know I pissed myself in my clothes, but I'm taking a shower in my clothes as well. I am, however, going to use some of my money to go across the street to my beloved hotel room. Oh, babe, you're waiting for me. Ooh, I like this. Unfortunately, though, I'm sleepy, babe. And this bed only has room for one person, so... Okay, that works, yeah. Second week of June, that's how behind we are. An online poll has identified Babe as the most popular wrestler in the world. I'm not surprised. I mean, look at her. Listen, Nate, I've been keeping an eye on your progress, and I think some changes need to be made. Oh, do you? You don't have a good enough attitude to help with what we're trying to build here. What does that mean? My attitude's fine. Improve your attitude to 74% by the second week of July, or I'll give your spot someone who appreciates it. How do I improve my attitude? Coach Emerson, what the fuck? Stay away. Oh my god, Jigsaw Jeremy. Man, this is rough. I don't know how to improve my attitude. All I know is I need to eat some stuff, otherwise this is going to be a very short match. Anyone have any floor bananas or something? Slow down, Nate. Running may get you there quicker, but also makes you tired. Don't tell me what to do, Sergio. I need floor bananas. Oh, wait. I think I'm actually supposed to be on. I gotta make it. I gotta go. No, idle ghost. No, I, I know. I appreciate you, but I gotta go. I'm gonna be late. Quickly. Oh, my God. I missed the call time. Oh, well, it happens. All right, I better go home and hide and avoid uh, Wormwood because that's just awkward. Ah, oh, shit. Wormwood is in my house. Why are you dressed like me? Nah, Wormwood, this is unacceptable. I'm gonna fuck you up. I'm tougher than you, Nate. Don't start something you can't finish. Yeah, right. All right, Nate, you proved your point. I don't want any more trouble with you. All right, is that right, Wormwood? Is that right? Oh, yeah, that's right. I have to increase my attitude, which I don't even know how to do. This game sucks. It doesn't suck. I love this game. It's so fun. I'm on my way to the street. Uh, if you need a ride, Nate. You know what, babe? I would love to join you for a car ride. Please, take me. No problem. Just follow me, and I'll get you to the street as soon as possible. Thanks, babe. 
I appreciate that. I know I could have just walked outside, but you gave me a ride. I appreciate it. Heard you've been starting fights, Nate. You need to save that energy for the ring. You can't prove that. If you make this an unsafe work environment, then I'll just have to keep you out of it. Okay, well, that fight didn't even take place here. It took place at my home. Allegedly. You let a lot of people down when you missed your call time, Nate. Listen, Elm. I don't care. Don't give me shit. I already have to hear it from Coach Bitch over there. Oh, look at him. He's trying to start fights with me now. He wants to talk about creating an unsafe work environment. Look what he's doing. Okay, Elm, I actually appreciate you trying to help me there. Arrow, can you help me against Coach Emerson, please? That guy's a real dick. Would you like to buy this picture for $113? No, dude, I'm a... I know it sounds like glamorous, but I'm a pro wrestler. And I don't get paid that much. What, my attitude went down? Oh my god. Oh shit. Me and Coach Emerson are gonna have a fight right now. Oh, that's not even Coach Emerson. Just another bald guy. Sebastian Slobber. What a name. Okay, I hope everyone sees that I did not start this fight. Oh, I'm so sorry, Samuel Steele. Oh my god, Idle Ghost. They're all duking it out over there. Holy shit, Idle Ghost. You're a manager, but you can kick some ass, too. Oh, there he is. Coach Emerson. Get over here, you Dana White-looking ass. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. It's fate on sight, Coach Emerson. It's fate on sight. Oh my god, slam dunk. Dude, I was not even paying attention. I need to stop checking my phone. This is a very unsafe part of town. Hi, Elm. Good to see you. Hello, babe. A hug before bedtime. That's right. Elm, what are you doing, dude? I know there's one bed, but you don't have to sleep on top of the lockers. I wish I could buy another bed, you know, so we all could sleep here as a big happy family. Babe is, of course, the strongest wrestler in the world. We know this. What the fuck? You know who stole my clothes? I can't go out there looking like this. Who is this? Is, this, is that the bald guy who attacked me? Would you be willing to sell me your gear if I paid you $360 for your trouble? No. Go find your gear somewhere else. Thanks for nothing, Nate. Don't come crying to me when this happens to you. Why, Wormwood, are you copying my dressing style? You know scientists are studying people who have superhuman abilities? Oh yeah, Wormwood? Cite your sources, buddy. I want to see them sources. Okay, Devout, just like that. Wow, Wormwood, real quick to walk away from that. Devout, is this just because I didn't give you my clothes? Amy and Jude should be having their match now. Dude, I don't care. I'm in the middle of a brawl, okay? Oh god, I am definitely dead. Is there no one here today? Like, seriously, I'm just beating his ass, and there's no one else fighting me. I'm kind of surprised. Oh my god. Don't think I didn't see you there, Idle Ghost. I saw that. I don't know what maneuver that was, but that was very impressive. Oh, uh, Lucas Ackerblon. That's right. That. Okay, let's go, Lucas. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this singles match. Yeah, but no one's here. Oh, never mind. There is someone. Weighing in at 235 and standing at 5'10. First welcome, Nate. Weighing in at 182 and standing at 5'11, his opponent is Lucas Ackerblom. Lucas looks like he's into you. What? Bullshit. Lucas Ackerblom's so good. I'm I'm crying. I'm so distraught right now. Psych! I'm okay. Uh-oh. What the fuck? Wonder what happens if I just beat the shit out of Lucas Ackerblom. Like, I can just keep hitting him, just like this. I think Lucas Ackerblom's gonna be pissed, and rightfully so. Oh, even after the fight was over, I still smacked him in the face. That was very rude. Now let's get out of here. Come on, idle ghost. That will be out after the beating you put on him, Nate. What? He's right there. What do you mean? That means you're out as well until you learn how to behave. Dude, you are setting me up for failure. He's right here. He's setting me up for failure so hard. He's literally right there. You know what? Fine. I'll put him out. I'll put him out. I'll beat him so bad he's out. I'll put him out. Oh, he's gonna put me out in a second. Don't mind me, I'm grabbing this, and I'm just gonna whoop what's-his-name's ass, Devout, because he wants to fuck around. Actually, though, if you really think about it, it's Coach Emerson's fault. He's gotta pay. Fuck you, Coach Emerson. I thought you were so cool, and then you're trying to jeopardize, like, the whole situation. Suspending me for no reason? Jude, please, beat him up. Use that hammer. It's kind of weird that you have a hammer, but use it. I'm stronger than you, Nate. I don't care if you're stronger, man. I've got nothing to lose. I don't have very many friends here, as you can see. I'm kind of getting hurt. What the fuck, Jude? You see this? She just set this shit on fire. What a psycho. Also, no, that is not the end of it. Okay, maybe it is the end of it. I don't know. We'll see. All right, you proved your point. I don't want any more trouble with you. Meanwhile, I think I'm having a psychotic break. Ah, shit. I'm having traumatic flashbacks. I see him way the fuck over there, and he sees me. Did you know you get paid for any mess you clean up 
with the broom? No way, dude. Not like I picked this job to not do fucking manual labor, but you know, I'll take it. I'm here, Coach Emerson. We're gonna throw you on the goddamn subway. Coach Emerson, no, you get the fuck up. You're like so close, yet so far. Come on, Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Now we just need to wait for it to hit him, okay? It hit me last time, so it, it'll definitely hit him, right? Okay, well, he's unresponsive right now. Oh god, I think I might have actually put him out of his misery. You know what? I bet this game is fucking lame like this. I bet if I go right here and if I stand here, then I'll, I'll get hit by the train. You know what I mean? Like, the train will come for me now that I'm standing on it. But if it's just him, nope, no way. Oh, okay, I fell asleep right there, right by the body. Okay, interesting. Coach Emerson was found unconscious, and he's resting in the hospital for the next week. Like, he lost control for a while there. You need to look after your mental health. Sergio, I appreciate you looking out for me and everything, but trust me, that ship has sailed. What do you mean he'll be resting in the hospital? He's standing right there. Well, Nate, your time's up, and it looks like you failed to do as I asked. Oh, I'm afraid this is the end of the road for you. Maybe you'll put more effort into your next big idea. Yeah, you're right. My next big idea. What? No. Oh, it didn't let me kill him. Oh, I would have done it. Oh, no. Like, Nate is actually gone from here. All right, you know what? We're going to play as Coach Emerson, then. That's right, you son of a bitch. I'm getting the last laugh here. We're going to the train station. And we're starting to fight with Shane Asterisk. Come on, Shane, you piece of shit. I'm Coach Emerson, goddammit. I'll do what I want. What, what the fuck? What happened to me? Did I get hit off of the train? Come on, Coach Emerson. Get up, dude. You got this. All right, what you gotta do is you gotta take this thing. What does it say? Down with this sort of thing? Yeah. Oh, shit. That's pretty fucking funny. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Things are not going well for Coach Emerson. Coach Emerson was found unconscious and will be resting in the hospital for the next week. How did Sergio get, like, knocked out by the train and he's resting for five weeks? I got hit by it three times and I'm resting for one. I'm gonna roam around. I know I'm injured, but you better believe I'm fucking going back. Don't let anybody scare you out of taking this route. There are risks, but yeah, Amy, thanks. I appreciate it, but that's not what I care about right now. My goal is to kill Coach Emerson, okay? Oh, hello, fellow baldy. Oh, there we go. He's losing his mind. This isn't good. As long as he gets closer to the train station, that's all I care about. Look exhausted, Coach Emerson. Why don't you take a nap while there's still time? Coach Emerson looks so offended. He's like, you son of a bitch. Don't ever tell me to take a nap. Hello, Jude. I figure since I'm Coach Emerson, I will assault my friends. Uh, Todd, Todd snorting. Can you stop, please? I'm bleeding out of my ass, as you can see. Come on, come on. Yeah, that's how trains work. Everyone is so irresponsible. They didn't stop me. Oh my god, dude. Coach Emerson is a fucking zombie. Down with this sort of thing. It's gonna come from the other way, isn't it? Yep. Now just resting on top of him. Listen to him. He's probably definitely dying, right? Oh, he's still crawling. I see a little bit of hand movement there. Dude, how is he alive? Yeah, I don't blame you there having a mental break. I'd be kind of losing my fucking marbles too. Oh, it doesn't matter though. He's gonna get backed into by the train again. <laughs> Dear God. Poor Coach Emerson. Okay, I he's immortal then. You guys saw it. I saw it too. It ran straight through him and he did not flinch. He's taking a nap in the middle of the train tracks. What is wrong with this guy? There we go. He's died at the age of 51 with a meager savings of 5,000. I'm kind of mad though. He's won 0% of his zero matches, but technically that means he's undefeated. I should have made him go on a huge losing streak, but it is what it is. We didn't really play that long in the grand scheme of things this time, but I hope you guys did enjoy. I'm going to have to go through and rename some people to fit more of our subscribers and yeah, have to restart the career as Nate and see what happens. But I love you guys and appreciate you and I'll be back before too long with something else for you. Bye guys. Hey beautiful people, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. If you want to support me further, consider purchasing my book, American Icarus, available on Amazon. And if you just can't get enough of me, I'm a co-host of the podcast, A Random Gamer's Corner. You can give us a listen on YouTube, Spotify, or wherever you get your podcasts from. You can also follow A Random Gamer's Corner on Twitter. We'd love to hear from you. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.